What's up, everybody? We're back. Version 13.2.2. Where are we at here? 13.2.2. We're going to be heading to Chick-fil-A. Navigate to Chick-fil-A. Got it in the route. I do want to change the route up just a little bit here. Earlier, it gave us a route to take the feeder road. Looks like we are on the highway. We're on version 13.2.2, which has the end-to-end -end highway. It has the hurry standard profiles, chill profile. Drop it down to chill mode real quick. We are in standard currently. All right, now we're in chill. I want to see if this exit pops up here. I do want to show you the new weather display that you can route out. It does tend to zoom kind of far out, but you can kind of see the uh, precipitation in the area. Let's go back here. Just a short drive, 2.9 miles, 4 minutes. From here, we're going to navigate from Chick-fil-A to Smith's. And it doesn't look like it gave us our route. So we'll just take the freeway there. As always, the goal is zero disengagement, zero intervention. Let's go ahead and put it into hurry mode, see what happens. We do have bogeys behind us. Let's lower the um, max offset. 72. So on the freeway behavior, I've noticed it hugging the inside lines, mostly this one on the right, but also it does this new swaying behavior. Prior, earlier versions would be dialed in straight on the road. Now it tends to kind of sway around very slowly. It does feel more human-like, but I kind of like the robotic feel of being locked in on the, the lane. I don't know. So what do you think about that, Chris? Do you notice uh, that as well? I do notice that, yes. Um, I like it how it was before, yes. Yeah, even right now, it kind of feels like it's swaying it with the wind, which kind of mimics, like I said, a human driver. All right, we got our arrow on. We definitely have room. It's just very slow to proceed here. Alright, finally take an initiative. Definitely much smoother on version 13, but still kind of, they need to turn up the uh, confidence level, really. And I feel like they turned down the confidence level just so they can get it pushed out with the holiday update. Again, we got our blinker on, she's kind of now waiting for the car, but we did have time earlier. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Here's our exit. Now here's another turn we get to, another sweeper we get to test out prior, earlier versions on version 12. It would do 65 on this turn. We got our turn coming up. Let's see if she's We do down. have it in hurry mode. We are in hurry mode. That's fine. <laughs> Let's just see what happens. Uh, we are in the right lane, so that's a plus. And we're following the car, so it's not, not a great example to be able to test it out, but nice and smooth. Then we got Chick-fil-A on our right, and we'll test out another park. It's so smooth now that I can imagine if you were in a robo taxi and you weren't paying attention and it missed the exit, you wouldn't even know. <laughs> it would just be like, until you look up. <laughs> <laughs> That's facts. <laughs> it's so smooth, you know, you really can't even feel it. It's so smooth to exit the freeway. Yeah. All right. So the first test we'll test is to see if it tries to park itself, which I doubt because we're still waiting on those profiles. But let's go ahead and... Um, as soon as we get straight here, let's disengage and see if we can back it up. Yes. So go ahead and disengage. Okay. Let's try um, it right here. I'm going to pick one while you're rolling. Alright, vehicle. Okay, so you don't have to be completely... Oh, there's cars behind us. Alright, go ahead and take over. Alright, so that's a perfect example of using auto park. I can't. Drive. Go straight, honey. Yeah. Perfect example using an auto park in a parking lot and we got someone backing what? out here. It's almost impossible to use. I'm going to tell you that right now. If we would have started that, we would have caught a road raid. They probably would have had to back up with traffic. We really need to be able to pull into a spot. You can't always choose to back in. Right. All right, let's just go ahead and pull in. We'll grab some sandwiches and then we'll head back out. Right here looks good. <laughs> 
Navigate Dismiss. Let's see here. We're going to go to the Smith Sky Canyon. Click it. And we are 4.1 miles, 11 minutes. We are here in the Chick-fil-A parking lot. This is a crazy parking lot. Let's see if she can get us out. Christy just mentioned, oh, I think we got to get out this way. I said, no, we don't. We're not driving. All right, let's see if we can get out of here. <laughs> yeah, we have to go out that way. Kind of tricky because there's quite a bit of traffic. Oh, someone doing about 25 rolling in here. All right, we're clear. Oh, she's going to go the wrong way. This is wrong. Okay, go ahead and cancel. All right, let's go ahead and go the right way. So just get her out of this situation, and then we'll restart. Disengagement number one. We definitely... Now that guy's going the wrong way. We're not going to follow him, though. No, 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 no. Because this is a dangerous parking lot. Mm -hmm. All right, so go ahead and put in drive and go and re-engage. Let's get out of this parking lot. Actually, are we stuck now? No. Um, go this way. Go this, go way. this way. All right, engage. There we go. So that just goes to show if it can't go the right direction, <laughs> yeah, we need to be able to knock out all these little small bugs for Robo Taxi World. She does like to go the back way though, so this is fine. <laughs> yes. Ooh, it's getting hot out here. 68 degrees in the winter time in Vegas. Yeah, it feels like 75 outside. It does. So it looks like we're going to be taking the service road. I like this route. Then it's going to take the back roads as well. Clear after this car. See it kind of getting close to the line. That's a perfect example of how this new version is kind of mm. hugging the inside line. Super smooth to a stop. There was a version a couple months ago that would try to take a left over here instead of continuing straight, but I think that's been fixed. I want to say the other day it actually moved us over to the right lane. Yes, it did. Still kind of leaning towards the side of the inside now, but like again, with this version, it, it doesn't do this ping pong and it does this swaying motion, like almost like a normal driver not paying attention and it kind of sways back in. It's so strange. Maybe they have to adjust the parameters since they're using the higher resolution cameras now. Now this is another fail. We're about to drop into a one lane. Go ahead and disengage. Alright, so we're going to disengage. The guy behind it in front of us is probably wondering what the heck is going on. Re-engage. That was a fail. In a robo-taxi world, that cannot fly as well. I mean, obviously we, we would have taken an evasive maneuver. She would either braked hard, but we weren't going to let it go to that point. No, safety. Safety first. She is in hurry mode, though. Yeah, I feel like even in hurry mode, it needs to understand the concept of the roads. It needs to know that it was yes. going to one, and you're not, you know, even if I, I mean, maybe I would have gone around if I was driving myself, right? But I would have been doing like 25 over. It would have been definitely against the law. <laughs> I'm not sure if I saw a sign there where it shows the lane ending merging into one. Yeah, great, great point. And that's the thing, it has to be able to do all these maneuvers even in the worst conditions, you know? Yes. Looks like we are going to cross straight over Durango, go back through some more city streets. There is some construction here, so we'll see how she acts. Nice smooth takeoff from the green light. Now, ideally, we'd want to be in this right lane to merge straight through the center section. 
This lane works too, but ideally I'd like to be in the right lane. Got the green light. Three hours later, I do hear honking in front of us it looks like. Can't see what's going on, but. All right, we're back everybody. Had to take a quick phone call there. Not sure what happened. FSD was driving. I wanna say there was some crazy, a car tried to cut us off. You missed a lot, but we're continuing. Got three stop signs ahead and a right turn. I like that behavior, arrow it on to merge over. Full Nitsa stop. I'm sure that car behind us, the two cars behind us, loved it. And now we're going out to the wide right I here. I don't like how it does this. Yeah, yeah it's so that, odd. That's a broken behavior right there. I don't think I've seen it do that in months on version 12, but that was the first time here on version 13. This is day two of 13.2.2 .2 for us, and I have to imagine they're already working on another point release update. There's quite a few bugs in this one. Yes. Yeah, this area here on the right, they, they're they always trying to get on top of people for uh, dumping their trash, because look, it's a giant area, you know? Mm. You'll find like couches, dark dump chairs. area, yes. Yeah. This has been like this for quite some time. I'm sure it's gonna get... Developed? Developed soon. Got a right turn coming up, and again, we're kind of, we're not in the middle of the lane anymore. It used to traject right in the middle of, there's no lane lines, obviously, it's a big oversized lane, but it's, Following to the curb. It just looks weird if you have traffic behind it because they're gonna go around you. If you get that close yeah. to the curb, they're gonna think, oh, this guy's just pulling over. Yes. All right, we got two more cars after this one. Inside lane is free and we're clear. says stop wars instead of star wars on the back and someone ran the hell out of them they sure did are we going to go through this light and see if she, she can navigate us into the parking lot here at smith's and i can't wait until we can just do auto park but pull in instead of back up it's the back up that stops you you know yes. like because how many people go into the grocery store and Mine is Tesla drivers, right? But manually backing in. But no, <laughs> normally people pull into the parking spot. And we got the green light. I was just thinking how hyped up version 13 really was, you know? Is it living up to the hype? It's definitely a lot better, a lot smoother, and you can notice a lot of differences. But anytime they switch to a big dot release where they're using new... Uh, Perfect example of no U-turn right here. Sorry oh yeah. to cut you off. Almost got into an accident. Yes. But yeah, with the new camera vision, they're, they increase the frame rates. You gotta kind of expect some new dot updates to kind of tweak it here and there. And welcome to Smith's. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. Smash the like button, hit subscribe. But remember, your feedback is most important. And we'll see you on the next one.